you know, I wanted to share this story about trekking shoes, you know. Uh, if I've just bought new trekking shoes or, you know, the instructor that was, was about to go start doing some trek sometime, was told that shoes trek ko aane se pehle istamal kare. You know, if not, you're going to have blisters in your feet. Because if you're going to have blisters in your feet, you're going to have blisters. You're going to have blisters. And he said, you know, why is, it, why is he saying so? So I, he said, please use your shoes. So I started using my shoes and starting to walk around a little bit uh, with them. And yes, for really, I mean, the instructor has experience. Pairo mein blisters aane shuru ho gaye already. And the trek is still way back. So the idea is, you know, uh, we've got to practice uh, wearing our equipment before you get used to it so that you're not going to have blisters. That's the point. The point here is in business, let me ask you a question. When you go for a meeting, do you ever get blisters in your meeting? What do I mean by that? Do you go for a meeting like just like that or do you go for your meeting prepared? Matlab ye hai ki when you go to meet a customer, or a potential customer, do you know what is the outcome of a potential meeting that you want to expect to do? What, what do you really want to come out of that? Do you have a clear outcome walking into the meeting? Do you know a set of three to five questions that that potential person would ask you at any point and the number three thing that I would say is expectancy do you walk into the meeting with an expectancy ye bhai, hum to bhai share hai. You know, when I, I am going to get the result and the outcome that I want to get do you walk in the, with that expectancy when you walk with that expectancy and focus in teen cheese jab kare, that's the point when you do not get blisters in your meeting if not you go unprepared you're going to have blisters in your meeting it's going to give you lots and lots of pain so stay prepared Go prepare. Thank you.